cylinder on the other way. What about lifting that cylinder out with the lift? That's all oh, that I, I yeah, the shiv on there. It ain't that big. Last week it was an anaconda. Now it ain't that big. The cylinder ain't that big. <laughs> Isn't that something? So like I told Troy, we'll just pre pre make the cable on the floor, pretty much, because. Just got to put the ends together where it was broke, and then we'll have our length, and then put it in, thread it through on one end, and clamp it. Then we'll have to have that down because we need to know where the cylinder needs to go, up or down. I would say up raises it, yeah. So I'm just talking out my ass again. I know you know what you're doing. See? You know what you're doing? Are you farting? Are you like a little kid standing here put filling his diaper? <laughs> oh, you gotta love it. Troy fills his diaper all the time. I'm gonna go back over here and mess with him because that first video wasn't long enough. Yeah, pick it up when it dries. Look at Troy's up there cleaning out valves, and he found this in there, there. The spool stuck it on the cousin yesterday. The boom wanted to go up to heaven till it hit the lever, and then it wanted to go down to hell. It kept on going. Isn't that what he said? Then he got mad and ripped the boot off. Trying to think the linkage was froze up or something, but it was like 40 degrees out. Then Troy came around and looked at it this morning, and here it is. I'll tell him again, Troy. Which one was it, top or bottom? You got it all on there now. I can't. There we go. Oh, here we go. There's the pieces, man. Look at. The hard plastic. That's what's called investigative sleuthing into finding out where that stuff comes from so we don't. So, yeah, and he took the valve apart and there's more stuff in there. So. All right, now I got a five minute. So, you're going to reseal that whole side then? You pulled them all out and that's where it was stuck in the jib boom next? Oh, Stand the boom. Oh yeah, that's right. This has got an extender on her. Right. Okay. So that tells you, and you guys that know circles, you know there's two valve banks on there, one on each side, one for each joystick. Correct. They're not connected between them, so to speak. They are two individual valve banks, if I remember right. Uh, the pressure is coming from the same place, but, same place, but yeah, yeah. And the returns come together. So you don't want to pull the spools out of the other one just to check it? Not really. Oh. Okay. So yeah, that happens. This truck is five years old and nobody changed the filters ever, and that's probably what happens. Heat affects that plastic, you know, just like O-ringies. Are you talking about that, Troy? Oh, I thought you were. I thought you were taking a whiz off the ladder. That'd have been cool. Uh, let's see what you got up there. You got one more left, huh? Yeah. All right, well, that's it for today's video. What do you guys think? Last day of the week for us. Screw it, right? Or do you want to work tomorrow?
Depends on what we get. He wants. He, uh, he's driving that spare truck, but he he would like it by Tuesday, Monday. We'll see what happens. Just say see you. Bye. Bye.